Hi guys. Well, it is sort of a gorgeous summer day here in the end times. 91 degrees. 91 degrees on Friday, July 1st. We are halfway through the year 2022. And uh, I am out of tequila here as I got all of these people coming in to Bugs in a Jar Farm and I am out of tequila and I am on a search for a kitchen trash can which has turned into quite the uh, quite the wild goose chase. You would think looking for a kitchen trash can should not be that much of a challenge. Good fucking God, everything is a challenge. So of course the main challenge is getting this damn truck to start. So uh, <clears throat> when was it? It was, let's see, when was Alistair here? And uh, so anyway, uh, what happened when Brother Alistair and I uh, were out running around getting rocks and stuff uh, last week, either Monday or Tuesday. Anyway, what happened is the goddamn ignition switch on this truck, uh, which has never had a blemish in it, decided to break and get stuck and uh, about fucking uh, waylaid us out there at that quarry and whatnot. So anyway, I ordered, it was Tuesday afternoon. So anyway, uh, it, it was Tuesday afternoon. Go on to carparts.com uh, where I I've had good luck with carparts.com to get this ignition switch. The thing is $118, and they said you have two shipping choices. That, uh, you know, for the free delivery included in the price, you should expect your package on Friday, July 1st, or you can pay the $30 $30 guaranteed delivery on Thursday, June 30th, meaning yesterday. So uh, I was asking Rob, because he's the one who's going to be changing the ignition switch, and he said, you're totally fine till Friday. Don't waste the 30 fucking dollars. So anyway, I did not spend the $30 for the guaranteed two-day delivery, so I ordered the thing. And that very day, uh, I get an email from Car Parts. Now that night, so that you know, they said you should receive this on uh, on Friday. And then that very evening, I get an email from Car Parts. All right, you're going to have your thing on Thursday. Uh, that FedEx will bring it to you on Thursday. And then, of course, uh, so that was Tuesday evening. Even though I didn't pay the $30, they said, you're going to get it by 9 p.m. on Thursday. That's what they tell me Tuesday night. So then I get up Wednesday morning and have a uh, thing from FedEx saying, Sorry, you're going to get your package on Saturday, July 2nd. So we've gone from Friday, July 1st to Thursday, June 30th to Saturday, July 2nd. Now FedEx had it in their possession at 9 o'clock on Wednesday. Car parts, they got the fucking order uh, Tuesday afternoon, had it in FedEx's possession. This is in California on uh, Wednesday morning. What was that? What was at nine o'clock Wednesday morning, June 29th, FedEx 
had the goddamn ignition switch in their possession and said I would have it by Saturday and you can take a wild guess what the email tracking uh, was today. Now they're saying Wednesday, July 6th. Wednesday, July 6th. So I, if I had paid the 30 fucking dollars, I would have had this goddamn thing in my hand. And so now, until at least Wednesday, I got to drive around freaking out that the fucking truck is not going to start. Uh, Jesus fucking Christ. Every fucking place I go. So maybe the truck will just break down in front of the fucking liquor store. And, uh keep me out of my misery at the uh, at the liquor store uh, Jesus anyway right now it is off to buy a uh, off to buy a trash can and uh, I'm sure I could make an, a whole new rant about what I'm going through looking to buy a fucking kitchen trash can. <clears throat> this should not be a fucking drama. But welcome to Hambone's world. I honestly don't know if it's just me or is it fucking everybody. It doesn't matter what you're trying to fucking do anymore. Order a fucking ignition switch from car parts, uh, taking eight fucking days for uh, FedEx to get it to you, or, or, or finding a, or driving all over the fucking planet uh, looking for a fucking garbage can for your fucking kitchen. You know, this really shouldn't be a challenge. Anyway, off I go. Uh, I'm taking the, Ambon is taking the garbage can challenge. Wish me luck. Bye, guys.